สวัสดีค่ะ I re upload this design again uh, with the voice over so I hope it can help you to understand clearly and all of these are the same design actually I just decorate them you know differently And for the yarn, like I said, we live in the different countries, so uh, we may get a different uh, yarn. So in this design, I recommend you to use the large side of you know the yarn that uh, can uh, use for the hook size, uh, three to three point five millimeter. For this sample one, I use around one hundred and fifty gram, and uh, you have to work it out which one is the best for you. So I will use this talk to you know for explaining but uh, please note is the same design as the yellow top okay so we will uh, first step we will do with the uh, first cup and then two cup join together here and from joining to the bottom here and next part is the uh, strap and two sides Let's begin the first cup. Okay, begin with five chains and single crochet three times into the second stitch. Two chains and turn over, begin the next row. Two single crochet into the first stitch. Three single crochet into the last stitch of the row. And then just repeat the same last row. So in this design you have to remember when you begin the new row, you have to do two single crochet into the first stitch. Do three single crochet into the last stitch. So do it nine rows in total. Alright, now 9 rows done. So do 2 cups the same, okay, and uh, begin row 10 to join them together. And when begin the row 10, uh, no need to increase the first stitch and the last stitch. Just uh, do 1 single crochet for the first stitch and the last stitch, no more increasing. Then bring the other cup to connect them together. Just single crochet into the first stitch. Then single crochet until finish row 10. Have to do 28 rows.
All right, so now I got uh, enough for uh, this side, you know, on the uh, cup, nine rows, and on the body, it's the uh, 28 rows, so uh, completely done. So from now, we will start to do the uh, side, one side first. Okay, for the strap on the side, uh, let me explain you this. So do four double crochet and three chain, four double crochet, you know, four, four times. Okay, and make it for uh, 10 rows. Okay, and then you have to do the other side is uh, the same. Or maybe you would like to make the strap is bigger you can make like you know six times whatever you like okay next step is the bottom here so on the first row just do five chains and single crochet and uh, skip for three stitches and single crochet five chain and single crochet For the second row, 5 chain and 1 single crochet. And again, 5 chain and 1 single crochet. Then 9 double crochet into the same stitch. And then just single crochet to the next stitch and that's it for this row you just repeat the same until you finish the row Okay, so um, row two done. Now we'll begin the uh, five chain for the next row. The third row, uh, do five chain and then single crochet into the uh, uh, next stitch, and one chain and one double crochet uh, for nine times and then single crochet to the next stitch
Okay, yeah. When you got it and uh, uh, repeat the same in you know, a five chain and single crochet, and then uh, do the uh, one chain and one double crochet for nine rows again. Uh, uh sorry, for nine uh times, and then you know keep doing like this uh until you finish the row. now done so next part it's the uh, on the top here uh, on the top just do a uh, five double crochet into same stitch and single crochet okay now uh, the top done so actually I show you guys all the parts but there is a question like how to connect you know it at the back so well you know actually uh, you already got strap for both sides and just tie it up you know that's all like this And for the decorative pattern on the top of my work, uh, many people may wonder how I did it. Actually, I use, you know, embroidery techniques. And I use the sewing machine to sew it again. The use of sewing machine, you know, help the work looks neat. And so I did not show you how to embroider it, but you know, as you know, there are so many video tutorial. You can find it on YouTube. Okay, that's it. Um, I hope this video can help you to make this design. Thank you for watching.